Hey guys, welcome to my quick ROM overview of the Dirty Unicorns ROM for your XT910 or XT912 in the future. So XT912 is under development and will be released soon. And yeah, this is by far the most customizable ROM I've ever seen for this device. I will show you in these settings that um, yeah, customization is um, endless for this device in this ROM. So these are your quick settings. Um, you can see that you have dirty tweaks, for example, and these are your um, ROM control things. You can um, customize here like system status bar, multitasking, uh, navigation bar, um, general UI. I can't show you every single uh, settings menu, but I will show you the ones which are most important. Like you can change uh, custom progress bar. I chose uh, I chose some uh, other colors here. You can uh, change them, of course. A power menu. You can also enable screenshot and a navigation bar. And yeah, this is your uh, power menu here. So now we have screenshot and navigation bar. Um, initial uh, D tweaks. Zip line apps on each boot, fix permissions, clear cache on each boot, which could potentially uh, boost your device. <laughs> you have any, everything you can think of here. Um, John, journalism tweaks, um, super tweaks, speedy modified. That sounds really cool. So let's check that. And loopy smoothness also uh, sounds great. I'm not a developer, so I don't exactly know what that is and uh, yeah you can also go for uh, build prop mods um, proceed with caution davic uh, size build number you can also change that and let's go for notification drawer you can change the background uh, transparency notification transparency let's go for a system you can change the animations like um, the uh, system Wow, that's just, um, that's outrageous. That's um, over the top. This ROM is so customizable. It's it's um, unbelievable. So let's go for um, translucent. Wow, yeah, works good. And uh, yeah, looks good. Um, this is the, okay. Okay, we have a funny bell here, which um, symbolizes no recent apps. Uh, as you can see, I have the uh, recent, recent uh, the uh, used RAM in my recent apps menu. And uh, yeah, let's go back to dirty tweaks. And let's now go for uh, another setting here, which is very cool, like. Like uh, the ad, ad blocker is very nice to have that. You can disable ads with just one tap. And um, here you can um, update the host file. Like if you have this enabled some weeks and then uh, an app will show ads, that means you have to update the um, ad blocker, the hosts file. And um, Wakelog blocker is very nice. I didn't, it's kind of uh, new to me because. Um, I always check for wake locks um, with the app wake lock detector, which is in the Play Store and it's free. Um, recents, recents panel color. Um, you can also go for slim recents. Uh, we'll show you how that looks. Let's go for home. And now we go for recents. So these are your recent apps. It should show some, but i um, not exactly sure why why it doesn't. Uh, let's go for music. Now it shows music. And these are the slim recents, so it's a little bit different from the original Google recent apps menu. Uh, let's go back to settings. You can see these icons are also a little bit different from uh, AOSP because I use uh, this theme I showed you. Um, yeah, let's go for Dirty Tweaks once again. And yeah, it's very, it's just mind blowing how much settings you can uh, change here. 
uh, battery icons, of course, you get uh, different bat battery icons. I will show you the one I'm using. I'm using the circle plus percent battery icon, uh, circle animation speed when you're charging. You can also change that. Network traffic. Let's go for that one. Uh, States bar traffic monitor. Let's go for outgoing and incoming. Of course, there isn't one yet uh, now because um, I don't have uh, any uh, data enabled here for my review. But you can change that. It will um, show you how much up and down data you are having right now. It's um, refreshing like one second every second or so. Heads up, Omni Switch, file Control, Apple. I can't uh, explain everything here because just um, mess with it. But um, I can give you a recommendation. This one is really nice. If you are uh, loving uh, customization in your phone, then this is def definitely the the uh, right ROM for you. Uh, enable navbar. You can enable the lollipop style navigation bar here. Uh, miscellaneous. Double tap to sleep. Let's check that one out. Double tap on the status bar and um, yeah, it will go to sleep. This is my um, wallpaper. And yeah, we'll show you the wallpapers real quick. Go for uh, wallpapers, tap on that. And um, now you can choose the uh, the app, which is called uh, Dirt Unicorn Wars. And these are server-based, so they don't um, they don't um, waste um, storage on your phone. And yeah, these are already uh, only available um, when you're connected to Wi-Fi. Quickly, uh, we'll quickly connect to Wi-Fi. And uh, now we can see the traffic monitor, which looks really cool. And uh, yeah, good to know that. Incoming and outgoing data. And yeah, these are the Dirty Unicorn wallpapers, which are server-based, like I said. And yeah, very nice looking wallpapers here. I have to admit that, um, yeah, very minimalistic and very beautiful wallpapers. Um, yeah, for every taste. Uh, these are very, yeah, you can see uh, you get uh, lots and lots of wallpapers like uh, Dirty Unicorn, Team Dirt, AOSP, AOKP, LG, Oppo Moto, Sense, Touch Touchwiz, and um, let's check this one out real quick. Apply wallpaper. Yeah, great. <laughs> Just wait for it to load. Hit apply wallpaper and it will apply the wallpaper and it will tell you wallpaper set. And yeah, this is uh, what this ROM looks like. And I hope you found it help helpful to have this uh, little ROM overview. Yeah, still supporting this device. I will keep it. I have almost bricked it, but yeah, very good phone for playing around with these custom ROMs. I hope the developer will uh, fix these touch buttons here, which don't light up. But um, yeah, this will be uh, fixed in the next build, I think. But I'm not sure. But yeah, this is very good ROM. And you can also um, light these up uh, with um, an app, which is called a Keyboard Backlight or so. I'm not exactly sure. But I will. I guess the developer um, will fix that. So yeah, very customizable ROM. And I will see you in the next one. Have a great day. Bye. And outtakes. When you want to boot your device faster. Change build number. You can also go for... Um, what the fuck? TF. <laughs>